In many of my videos where I talk about photography in public and whether or not it's permitted and whether or not it might amount to an offence, I have always said that it will always depend on all of the circumstances of the case as indicated by the Court of Appeal. I've also said that this law is subject to change and I expect to see certain changes and there are certain situations that would be absolutely obvious that would just simply not be acceptable so you should expect changes in those areas of law. And it appears that I'm correct because there is a new law that is imminent which forms part of the Police, Crime, Sentencing and Courts Bill which is currently going through Parliament, which will create a new offence of taking photographs or taking other images of breastfeeding mothers in public without their consent. The new offence is going to be recording images of or otherwise observing breastfeeding without consent or reasonable belief as to consent. And for a person to be found guilty of this offence, the perpetrator must be acting for the purpose of obtaining sexual gratification or of humiliating, alarming or distressing the victim. Those who are successful prosecuted of this offence will find themselves on the sex offenders register and possibly jailed for up to two years. And in fact there was a similar change in the law just three years ago known as upskirting which was taking photographs up a person's skirt or dress and since then reportedly there have been 32 prosecutions for this offence. I'm sure we can all agree that this is something that no one should really be doing or want to be doing irrespective of whether a person is in public or not and as I've said any time that public photography comes into discussion I have always said that it does depend on all of the circumstances. Simply being in public does not and should not mean that all expectation of privacy is simply waved away. Feeding of a very young child is obviously necessary and may not always happen behind closed doors, but being in public should not just give everybody the right to film and photograph because frankly this is unacceptable behaviour. So I for one support this law and I hope that you will too as a respectable and responsible photographer or vlogger out in public. So please make sure you subscribe because I will do a full video on when the changes actually come into force and what that means for you if you incidentally capture somebody whilst maybe not deliberately whilst you are out vlogging in public.